Now after you're done drawing yourself and coloring yourself in, we are going to work on the background. Now for the background, you want to use either warm colors, which are red, orange, or yellow. Colors that remind us of fire and things that are warm. Or you can use cool colors, your blues, greens, and purples, things that make you feel cool and calm, things that remind you of water. You can use either or, so either warm colors or cool colors. Okay, friends, so I'm just gonna take my paper towels and gently touch on my colors. I'm gonna make sure that each paper towel that I touch my paint with is clean. I don't wanna touch my paint with this. I wanna find a nice clean spot and touch my colors to make sure that I don't have any water puddles. Okay, I am going to use watercolor for my background as well. I'm just going to wet my red, just like that. Then I'm just gonna color it in. You can use anything that you want. You don't have to use watercolor. I'm just gonna show you how I use watercolor for my royal portrait. And warm colors also include your pinks. So pink is a warm color. Okay, so now I'm going to use some pink. I'm going to use some orange. And last but not least, I'm going to use yellow. Okay, and then after I'm done, I'm going to wipe off my palette, start to gently tap on my colors that I use with a clean part of my paper towel, and then I'm going to wash off my brush and my water cup. You also want to close your palette and take your painting to a nice, safe place. So pick up your painting with two hands and take it to a nice safe place to dry.